Alright. Got it. Okay. Now this one might be the funniest of the ones I'm gonna show you. That's up for you to decide. Thanks for the five subs, Rumble Rob. Okay, are you ready for Blunderfest? And yeah. everybody's invited? Mm -hmm. Okay, there's many blunders starting from here. This is Abdus Satorov versus Cheparinov. Abdus Satorov, as you remember, won the rapid uh, yesterday, but this isn't the rapid. Okay, this position is a draw. It's all zeros. Now, you can't play king takes bishop because it's defended by the pawn, so it's illegal. You can't play pawn takes because it's pinned, also illegal. If you can't take this bishop, the next best thing to do would be to take this pawn on the seventh rank. God damn. Mm -hmm. Therefore, the only drawing move is bishop d5. And then you'll, you, will, you will take that. D, you, and you defend this pawn. Yeah. And you defend this pawn. Okay. And the engine says this is correct play. And the reason is if you go here, you're, you're losing. And then Rook here pins the bishop forever, ever. Forever, ever? Forever, ever. We live in Atlanta. Okay. So, so after here, we go back here, threatening this pawn. We can't defend it this way because the bishop would be hanging. So you got to, so just always repeat. Okay. So the game should have ended that way. Instead, black blundered. Cheparinov did not play bishop d5. Uh, let's see what's going on here. Okay. He played king b4. Why did he play king b4? I'm going to tell you why. Because he wants to take the bishop. See, he unpinned himself. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, you know, Sindarov, I mean, so Abdu Sator is pretty good. He's world rapid champion. So he saw his bishop was attacked. And he played bishop c2. And the engine says good, good. Because now black can resign. <clears throat> black has nothing. I play bishop takes pawn. <clears throat> and that's it. Game's over. <clears throat> So now the engine says white is like plus seven after king b4 instead of bishop d5 drawing. That's blunder number one. And I showed this position to the count, and you know what he said after this? No. One. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> okay. I, I didn't even have the right count. Now he played. Counting a duke. And I'm like, what? It, now he played. <laughs> now he played c3. Okay. After c3. He was PO'd because white played bishop takes e4, and there's no r2d2 because it's defended, right? Okay. Now, this is obviously winning for white. This pawn's defended the most. This pawn is stopped the most. This pawn's hanging. Black can't do anything. Black can resign again. Okay? And black played bishop f5. And the engine says white is plus 10, plus 20, plus 30. And every move wins. Not only does every move win, if it's black's move, black can resign. Black has nothing. Black has no move. Nothing. And the engine says the easiest way to win is takes, takes, g6. I got two pawns, one for each of you. And then it says black resigns. This pawn's not dangerous. These pawns aren't dangerous. And then these pawns are dangerous. God damn. It's G7, rook here, 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 extra queen. Okay. And it says plus 10. Okay. But actually, if it was black's move here, black can resign. Black doesn't have any moves here. All right. Now, this is one of the worst moves of the day. Maybe when that guy hung his queen, that was worse. After bishop f5, Abdu Satorov made the worst move he's ever made in his life. And he just won the world championship. God damn. Come on, hype train. We need three subs. Stat. Are you ready for this move? Okay. Yeah. Abdu Satorov played rook c8. It's good, except for one thing.
he was probably thinking, I'm attacking the Rook, and I've defended my B-Pawn. Thanks, JA928, for the 10 subs. Five seconds too late, but you, we still need the 10 subs. So. Yay, thank you, JA928. Right. Now, that's the worst move ever. Now black has a move that draws and a move that wins. What's the winning move for black? Um, what do you need for black? Wouldn't you just take the rook? I need a move. Um, bishop c8. Yeah. I was just trying to see why that would be bad. <laughs> well, I mean, White's crazy like Fox News. That's the world champion for you. One day you're world champion, the next day you miss Bishop takes Rook. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, everybody yeah. makes bad airs in Blitz. Yeah, and, uh, and that's it. Game's over. <laughs> and then he resigned. Now, let's assume he didn't see Bishop takes Rook. Okay? Mm -hmm. Can we assume that? All right. Also good is Rook takes Rook. Yeah. Okay, and the engine says this is a draw. So, I, I mean, here's a position where black has no legal moves. The Rook is defending this. Bishop's defending this. They're both stopping this. I have a passed A pawn later. So, if it's black's move, white's completely winning. And he, and he goes here losing to Bishop takes Rook. What? Yeah, horrible. And then he resigned. That's a world champion for you. So, so, the, so there was lots of blunders there. Black was drawing with bishop d5, and he played king here losing. And then white was winning with any legal move, and he played here losing. They don't make them like they used to. Yeah, and that, that was it. Yeah. Didn't see the bishop guarding c8. I mean, bishops move diagonally. Yeah. Truth hurts.